Hello there guys and welcome to this Explain 12 performance video. In this video I'm going to show you a couple of tweaks that will help eliminate stutters in Explain 12. Well, perhaps not entirely. In my case, the tweaks I am about to present in this video have eliminated all stuttering in my flight sim experience in Explain 12. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to head over to the NVIDIA control panel, select Manage 3D Settings. From the Global Settings tab, make sure you click on Restore to restore all original settings. Then scroll down until you find the shader cache size. By default, the driver default will be selected. Make sure you select Unlimited and click Apply. Next. We're going to go to the Program Settings tab and we're going to select Explain from the drop down menu. Next, we're going to scroll down until we find Low Latency Mode. Change this to Ultra. Next, change the Power Management Mode to prefer Maximum Performance. And lastly, go to Threaded Optimization and turn this option off. I have done extensive testing on this specific option with it turned on, off, and auto. And I have found that when this option is either on auto or the on option, there are some pauses that happen every 30 seconds or so. But with the threaded optimization turned off, there is absolutely no stuttering whatsoever. Next, we are going to delete the NVIDIA shader cache. Please note that you need to repeat those steps every time there is either an NVIDIA driver update or an X-Plane 12 update. Also, please ensure that X-Plane 12 is not running when performing this activity. We're going to go ahead and type percent app data and percent and hit enter. Then we're going to select app data. We're going to select the local folder, type in to search for the NVIDIA folder. From the NVIDIA fo folder, we're going to select DX Cache. Now, as you can see, there is a lot of files here. We're going to delete all those files. When you do delete those files, please note that some files will still remain. So we're going to say delete, and we're going to say do this for all current items and skip the items that cannot be deleted. The remaining files are okay as they are not used by Xplane 12 and it is perfectly okay for these files to remain. Next, we're going to go again to the NVIDIA root folder and we're going to go to the GL cache. We're going to right click and delete this folder and now we are ready to go. We are now at London Stansted in the Laminar default A330. As you can see here, there are no stutters whatsoever as I pan around the 3D cockpit. Let's go ahead and take off and put our tweaks to the test. Parking brake is released and we're going to go for maximum power. And as you can see here, as we roll down the runway, the experience remains to be very smooth with no stuttering. No jitters whatsoever. And as you can see here, as we lift off from London Stansted and retract our gears, no stirring whatsoever, very smooth experience. Well, folks, this is pretty much what I wanted to share with you in this short video. I hope that those tweaks would help improve your experience in x 12. As usual, if you have any questions, please do post them in the comment section below. Until next time, please take care of yourselves and each other, and I will see you all very soon. Thanks for watching, and bye-bye for now.